Hello friends, you are watching Android Tech Solutions and today in this video I will show you how can you set up an Apache web server in Ubuntu. So basically I am using Ubuntu 19.04, the latest version of Ubuntu. If you are using some older version like Ubuntu 18 or 17 or 16 or 15, no matter, this video will work for you. So basically in this video I will show you how can you set up a web server using the software Apache. Okay. So Apache is the software or you can say the package which is responsible for setting up a web server in Ubuntu. Okay, so I'm going to show you how can you set up a static uh, website on Ubuntu. Okay. So first of all, you have to update your uh, apt repositories by running this command. sudo apt update. Then we are going to run this command. sudo apt install apache2. So the package for apache is apache2. Almost all the websites which are running on uh, the internet today are most of them most of or you can say 70 to 80 percent website are hosted on Apache. Okay, there are many other web server softwares available in the market like Nginx and Voy, but Apache is the most famous web server available in the market today. Okay. Now there's a document root. Okay, what does document root means? Document root is the place where we have to upload our website content. Okay, so the document root here is cd slash where dub 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 html. This is the document root. If I do ls over here, so here is one index.html file which is present over here. Okay. So before uh, opening this file or editing this file or creating our own content or uploading our website content to uh, over here. So what I would do is I will start a service. I'll just run this command sudo systemctl start apache2. Apache2 is the service which is uh, basically for running web server. And I'll simply open my web browser. Before that, I'll check my IP address. So this is my IP address and through this my IP address, I'm going to access my web server. Okay, this is my web browser. I'll just copy paste that IP address or you can even open it by localhost. Localhost or yeah. So here you can see Apache 2 Ubuntu default page. So this is, you can say, uh, a success message that Apache has been successfully configured on your machine. Okay, Apache web server has been successfully configured in your machine. And here if you read, it says Apache HTTP installed at the site is working properly. You should replace this file located at this before continuing to operate your Apache server. Okay, so this is the file. As I, as I told you, like where triple w HTML is the document root. And this is the file which right now we are seeing index.html. So we are going to modify it or we are going to upload our content over on this uh, directory. And rest here you can see all about Apache. What are, what are the configuration files? Everything detailed information you can go get over here. Okay, all the directory listing like the uh, configuration file of Apache. Configuration file of Apache is located at etc Apache 2. And the main configuration file of Apache is uh, which is it is located under etc apache2 apache2.conf okay so if you want some detailed information you can definitely read this file okay this content is very good to like understand what each configuration file means okay yeah okay now I'm going to modify that file okay so I'm going, going to you can modify that file or you can remove that file. Okay, just I'm removing that file. Now I'm going to create my own file. And you have to make sure the file name is index, index.html. Okay, 
because the directory indexing in apache is like once you are going to create a file name index.html automatically when when you are going to access the website you will try to access the website the index.html page will pop up okay if you are a web developer then you better know what is index.html file okay that is the main file or the primary file which is executed on the web browser okay so right now i'm just going to type a little html code And here I'm just going to simply write hello world. Okay, so this is my simple HTML code. And after writing this code, I'm just going to simply restart the service. It's not mandatory to restart the service, but it is better that you restart the service after you make change in the code or if you make change the configuration file. Yes, and now we are going to try to access it. And here you see hello world like I wrote an HTML code uh, which was hello world and it is being displayed over here okay so we can conclude that this is the directory path where triple w HTML where you have to upload your content okay uh, upload your website content uh, basically now right now Apache is configured to host uh, static website static website you can it means you can run HTML CSS JavaScript and all the static content you will be able to uh, display on your web browser on or basically host on your web browser okay but while you want to run a dynamic website HT, uh, PHP or MySQL so that won't you won't be able to do right now okay so I've made a video on that as well like uh, how to set up PHP and MySQL and I've given the link in the description of that video so you can check out that one so this video was basically on uh, how can you host a static website on Apache web server I hope this video helps you so thank you guys for watching this video, do like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more amazing tutorials.